Happy Saturday from Florida. Very hot Florida, by the way. Uh, so just got done touring a client. Uh, we toured two communities this Saturday. Um, so the purpose of this video, just a couple of things. One, I want to make sure that as you're considering senior living options, whether it's assisted living, memory care, uh, that you're actually taking the time to tour the communities, number one. Uh, I would highly encourage anywhere from two to three options to be considered and toured uh, to factor that into your, into your search and into your decision-making process. So that's number one. Uh, number two, uh, I would highly, highly encourage you to work with a senior placement company, uh, more importantly with a senior living advisor that's knowledgeable, that's going to give you insight on all the community options that you're considering. Um, there's a couple of reasons why. Number one is obviously every community is going to have a sales liaison. Uh, they do a pretty good job for the most part, some better than others, uh, but their focus is to sell their community, uh, not the industry, to sell their community. And of course, you can't blame them for that, right? That's, that's what they're there to do. So they're going to obviously you know, uh, do just that. They're going to sell their community. Uh, the reason why it, it is important for you to work with an advisor is because an advisor is going to be unbiased, okay, for the most part. Meaning, you know, you want to make sure that they're representing all communities. They've been in business for a while. I've made videos about this before. Um, make sure their credentials are solid. But a, a credible senior living advisor should be able to give you insight information on every community that that's out there that's a match for your loved one okay set up the tours for you accompany you on tours like today right so the purpose of the touring with the client is uh very uh impactful so for example uh the client that i'm working with now had a very specific budget it was a lower budget she wanted to stick with medicaid options in the beginning um so we shared those options with her and toured one or two places and immediately she changed her mind. She wanted to go at a higher budget and just do away with the Medicaid options. So now we're refreshing the list. Um, beyond the financials and the Medicaid, of course, level of care is very important. So here in Florida, I mentioned this in other videos as well, there's different licenses. Her dad has very specific level of care needs. Uh, so I've educated her on what license is the most appropriate for dad. Not all of them have that licensing. We got to sit down, look at the financials. We got to look at how much your room cost, uh, levels of care. I explained that to her as well. Amenities, average annual increases. The list goes on on what an advisor should be able to educate you per community. So then therefore you can make a decision and selection on your terms based on that information. Okay that's what you want to do you don't want to go into a place randomly or two places on your own you're given and sold information and you make a decision without being knowledge of your knowledgeable of your decision so highly encourage you multiple tours and more importantly work with an advisor so hopefully this tip helps